Hey guys, it's Retro Revival. We're on the 10th floor, so go now, 4th floor. I got the card key, so all you have to do to get it is go to the 5th floor, and um, it'll be w beside one of the Team Rocket guys. You have to go to the right instead of to the left. As you see, I got kind of stuck in the doors here. But it, or it's on the, yeah, fifth floor, yeah. See where that guy is? It'll be on the right side of where that Team Rocket guy is, right there. Right there is where I would be. Right there where I'm walking right now. So yeah, if you guys need the card key, that's where it's at. And uh, the rest of the floors kind of don't even matter. So that's why I was just going through them on locking doors and stuff. Because uh, the really important thing is that you get the Master Ball and the Lapras. Which is two things we're going to do in this game. So stay tuned, this is Pokemon uh, Fire Red Let's Play uh, episode, I think, uh, I'm not sure, 19 or 20, one of those. Uh, okay, so we're just, you know, lost in the Sofco building, but it's pretty easy once you get it down. You gotta just go, like, through all the floors, unlock all the doors after you get the card key from that dude right there. Or, you know, from the right side of him. Then, um... I just sped this part up, because it's the beginning, and quite, uh, you know, boring, probably, for everybody to watch. So, here we go, um... We'll be headed towards the place where we get the Master Ball, is what I'm headed towards. Also, there's a lady with a bed area which lets us uh, recharge our Pokemon or you know I mean heal them so uh, let's go for this Team Rocket Grunt we're going to destroy him then uh, yeah see check out the Porygon it's pretty good at destroying but yeah uh, where is the it's so confusing I swear but like just stay tuned we'll be good because I promise I'll find it. I always uh, take a minute to uh, regroup myself and then I'm good. So we're good. See here, here's where I was supposed to go and I didn't know. So Kadabra is our first. And we will get rid of it with Green Dot. <laughs> um, I want to say a special shout out to all my supporters. Cook Crumbit Cookie Gaming as well for uh, always leaving nice comments on my videos. I really appreciate it. Um, yeah. I noticed that like, most of my views are coming from a few videos, so I'm hoping I can figure out a way to uh, get more popular, but we'll see. Maybe in time I will. It's not, uh, perhaps it's not yet what is supposed to happen so we'll see what, I, what happens I'm hoping I get more popular just because I like doing this stuff for you guys you know I don't really know what I would do if it wasn't for having some way to express myself creatively as you see that lady will rest your Pokemon if you need them rested so um, that person's just there stuck so don't worry about them We'll go to the third floor. No, we won't. We'll go to the fifth floor again. And, uh, once again. For the 20th time. And, uh, inside this room, I don't know what there is, but it should have been at the third. Yeah. Yeah, we're going to the third floor. That's where it is. Or, I don't know, man. We'll figure it out. We'll figure it out. Welcome everybody, this is a frenzied beginning to the Let's Play of uh, Pokemon Fire Red episode. Not sure. Okay, so here we go. Uh, there's a door that's not unlocked. Okay, so here we go. This is actually probably... No, it's not. Okay. My goodness. And that woman's just trying to call on the phone. Okay. So here we go. That's not a dude who's gonna help us. We're gonna go down to the next. Um, I really have no clue. I honestly have no clue. This building is like a maze or something, bro. This building is a maze. 
Okay, it has something to do with this guy here, and the teleport there would be what I think. So we're gonna go through the teleport things where we're supposed to, and then, wait, where, how do I get to Giovanni? Because I know there's a, okay. There's, yeah. So, as we proceed, uh, very slowly, and with quite a bit of obstacles, I'll tell you. Because, you know, I was a little bit less in understanding what's going on in this video game. Because, like, why make such a huge maze? Uh, and for what purpose? Like... But, okay. We're gonna just continue to elevate and hope that this will save us. Uh, we'll go to the second floor and get on. Okay, here we go. And, uh... Something tells me I'd screw it up again, but we will see. Maybe not. Maybe not. Maybe I haven't. So here we go. We get some items in here. I think one's an Ultra Ball. And one's a HP up. That one I just picked up. Oh, that's an X Special. Okay. Then, perhaps... Hmm. Okay. We'll just um, head this way. No, that's alright. Oh, my goodness, I'm sorry, you guys. I'm really sorry it takes me forever to do this. But we'll, I'll show you how it happens. Like, it's just uh, quite a bit of a maze, which mazes are not my favorite. You know, water could save mazes, or they could. Water can, um, you know, figure out mazes. If you make a maze and then pour water in it, it'll find where the correct way out is, you know, physics. But not all the time, though. <coughs> because if there's, like, air bubbles and stuff, it screws it up. So, yeah, I'm sorry it takes me so long, guys. Uh, right now, we're gonna just get to what we're supposed to do. Because I have no clue where I'm supposed to be on this, uh, Sylph Company elevator thing. Where the heck? Man, this is real weird, dude. Okay, so, let's just head up in there. No, that's not it. That's not it either. My goodness, I should go to the level 3. It's in level 3. I'm pretty sure what I was supposed to do. Okay, third floor is probably the one. What have I done wrong? Okay. No. Okay, I'll, I'll, I'll figure it out. Because it's like... I didn't even prepare for this. Okay, sorry guys. I'm just taking my dumb time. Because I don't realize that I should have probably figured out before I made the video. I just figured I would do it with you guys instead of having to do it and then, you know, make the video and then all that. Uh, this is the one we're supposed to go. I know for a fact, yeah. Okay, Lincoln is here. Sorry that the first half was like really not a fun, you know, episode. Uh, this part will be good and it'll redeem it because we've got quite a bit to do we get a, a master ball from giovanni if we can beat him and also we beat this guy just because i mean it's always fun to destroy the rival guy um now the gold bat is trying to learn poison thing i don't know why i replaced bite with it because bite is a pretty good move but we're just going to uh, Gyarados, Gyarados, Gyarados. He's gonna get, no, he got my dude. He killed my Pokemon, bugs. Check it out, we got a Hitmonchan who's gonna do a Focus Punch. These Focus Punches are pretty cool though. But check it out, when you guys see the Focus Punch, you'll be like, whoa. So we're gonna make some room for Thunder Punch, Ice Punch. And, um, then there's one other one, I forget what it's called, but I'm not gonna teach that one. 
fire punch now we don't need it. Okay, Growlithe is the next, so we're gonna send out Porygon to destroy it. And hope that it will be able to. So lock on makes our accuracy very good. Side beam will destroy a lot of Pokemon but not the Growlithe. So we're gonna send Kropotkin out and he's gonna slam in the wind. So Venusaur looks pretty good but Kropotkin will take care of that I hope. If only Kropotkin can do this. Please Kropotkin do not fail me bro. Um, will he or no? Looks like he's gonna fail. Oh no. He said skin only to die, so he was poisoned, but we were paralyzed, but then he shed that, and then died. I said, oh, what? Pikachu got killed. Okay, please don't tell me we're gonna be whiting out. Yeah, we'll be whiting out. So, hey guys, everybody sucks sometimes, and today we suck. So, hey, uh, you know. <clears throat> we hope you excel, thank you, and I'll try this time. Sorry everybody that it was very annoying and I lost, but now we know what to do. Third floor, right here. And into our friend who we're gonna win this time against. Because we've got, let's see. Let's use that rare candy, I forget where we found it. I think maybe in the house picked it up or something. Or I found it in some dungeon. And then... We'll give the iron to a Kropotkin, why not? Alright, so let's see if we can do this better this time. Mm, yes, we can. I'll just continue as such ways. I should have healed my Pokemon in, uh, you know, the place where I was allowed to before. But I didn't. So, here we go. And I've got another episode ready after this one. So I hope you guys enjoy this one. I'm sorry started out probably pretty boring I can uh, I can imagine how boring it probably was so I apologize for that um and then I'm thinking I might do some other let's plays as well but I'm not sure I might finish this first you know like I kind of want to finish this game first before I do other ones but I'm gonna keep the mystery dungeon ones coming as well so we're gonna finish this one in Mystery Dungeon before we go on to another next Let's Play. And of course, he doesn't evolve for some reason. Which, if anybody knows, please let me know. But, uh, hey check it out, we got a Lapras. We're gonna name it Emma. After Emma Goldman. Because she was a nice woman. She taught me a lot from her writings. And I'll put uppercase A because it stands for Anapia, Anarchy. Okay, so let us just, oops, wrong, wrong one. We're gonna go back. And this will bring us towards, yeah, Team Rocket's dudes and then uh, Giovanni. So Giovanni's the top dude of Team Rocket, I assume. He's a top dog when it comes to Team Rocket, I suppose. So his grunts are gonna try to get us down, but we're gonna get the grunts down. It's all good. Everything's all blessed. We're gonna win. Because we're not gonna lose this one, for sure, people. We're not gonna lose. And Giovanni is gonna wanna battle us here. And so, what shall we do? We're not gonna lose against Giovanni. I know that one. But... Giovanni is probably pretty good at what he's doing. So, in that spirit, my guys, we're going to finish winning against Giovanni. And then we will then worry about what else happens. Woohoo, and we're good. So, hey, everybody. Um, oh, sorry. I screwed something up on my computer as usual, you know. Okay, so here's our battle with Giovanni. We got his Rhyhorn down. Got Tengus Khan down. And then... Let's see. He's changing his Pokemon to Needle Queen. Um, that's easy, that's good. And once we defeat him, we'll get a... I think it'll be a Master Ball or something like that. Yeah. 
Oh no, it's from this guy, yeah, exactly, so the president of Silvco, and I'm from Giovanni. Giovanni's not a good guy. Okay, so yeah, now we're headed towards, uh, back out the front, and thanks for watching this episode, you guys. This was a Silvco episode where we got our Lapras, we got a Master Ball, and we defeated our Arch Rival. So if you like, uh, share and subscribe, I really appreciate it. Um, yeah, I really appreciate you guys. Thanks for watching. Shout out to you guys, and we'll see you guys soon. Peace.